So hi everyone. Today we have Sadhvika with us. Sadhvika know me since one year. So Sadhvika, introduce yourself to everyone. Hi sir. Thank you for having me on your channel. My name is Sadhvika. I am from Telangana. I secured six eighty six out of seven twenty marks in NEET UG twenty twenty two, and my All India rank is four twenty five. Very good, Sadhvika. Your rank is very much exceptional. So Sadhvika, tell us about your story. Your NEET exam. How did you prepare for it? I started preparing for my NEET exam. I'm right from my 11th class. I prepare from a coaching in the nearby area, and I prepare regularly from the coaching. And I start using biohack in my 12th class. When I came across your video in the YouTube, I started using biohack because I found that methodology will work for me and can help me improve my score up to a large extent. You use biohack and chemhack both, right? Yes, sir. I use biohack and chemhack both. And what was the score in biology and chemistry? My score in NEET uh, exam in biology was 350 out of 360, and in chemistry it was 165 out of 180. How much you would say the score which you have gained, biohack or chemhack, has a role to play in it? 80 percentage of my score, biohack played a major role improving my score because I was not able to remember the exact points in NCERT even though I revised it multiple times. So biohack helped me improve my score up to a lot extent. Even the least explored topics of NCERT, which we think we would not cover, were actually asked in NCERT, and I started to focus and concentrate on them. Especially diagram-based questions and given in biohack were a lot helpful for me because I always used to forget the labelings and the diagrams. So it helped me a lot, especially with the diagrams and the concepts of NCERT, which I not used to cover, were covered. So I exactly knew where. I should focus on NCERT on which topic I should focus on NCERT otherwise I used to read full and I used to not get an idea where I should focus Sadhvika how did your biohack and chemhack help you So actually when I used to give tests in my coaching institute then I used to get so many questions wrong in biology before having biohack I used to get around 310 score in biology out of 360 but after reading biohack I understood where are my weak points and where I need to concentrate in biology so i actually did those questions right after using biohack and i used to cover most of the ncert and i used to feel a lot more confident after seeing my score because every point of ncert has been covered in biohack and i used to remember all of it and it helped me a lot during my revision so biohack helped me boost my score especially in the last days of revision it helped me revise some 3 to 10 times faster than what i used to revise before because it is a method of active recall as you said so it actually helped me boost my score a lot during the last phase of my preparation one time the exact question from biohack came in my test and i felt very happy it means i would actually not remember it if i would not have used biohack because i i used to ignore that topic it was from very deep line of ncert and i never expected a question from that topic and that question was there in biohack and the same question was asked in my test and i felt very happy sadhvika how did chemhack help you in what way chemhack actually helped me in lot in inorganic and organic chemistry i used to not remember ncert of inorganic Uh, chemistry especially the values of temperature melting point and boiling point those were very hard to remember so when i used to solve chemhack the questions were asked on them so i used to focus more on them due to chemhack i revised ncert multiple times so that i could easily remember them in the final neat exam and get a good score in my inorganic chemistry my organic chemistry became very stronger because chemhack almost every point of organic chemistry was covered of NCRT. NCERT so it helped me thoroughly remember everything every point of NCERT in physical also i used it and it helped me to remember the factual statements and concepts but it helped me more in inorganic and organic chemistry So Sadhvika will you suggest biohack and chemhack to your juniors Yes sir i would definitely suggest biohack and chemhack to the juniors instead i start suggest them to start using it from the 11th class itself because it helps us revise many times faster and they can also understand how to read ncert like 
what are the points least covered points in ncert which we will ignore generally they'll learn how to cover it when they start using biohack and they will actually start enjoying ncert because of the biohack because biohack has a different model i mean we should we learn the concept through the question and we'll also actually enjoy learning through the process so i will definitely suggest biohack and chemhack my junior so that they can revise ncert thoroughly and each and every point of ncert can be retained in the brain in a more enjoyable and joyful manner so sadhvika how much time did it used to take while revising one chapter of biology so ncert for revision it used to take 1 hour but from biohack i could easily revise in 30 minutes for long chapters and 15 minutes for normal or chapters so sadhvika what is the last thing you would like to say to all your juniors who are going to prepare for neat 23 or 24 i would uh, suggest them all to use biohack and chemhack because it helps a lot in our preparation of biology and chemistry biology and chemistry constitute a major part in the neat exam so by using biohack and chemhack we can actually score good marks and boost our score much more extent so you can use biohack and chemhack read from ncert in a more methodological and joyful manner and in a fun way actually which will help you to remember a lot of things and thus be confident in the exam about remembering ncert so i would suggest all my juniors to use biohack and chemhack during the biology and chemistry preparation so sadhvi what are the books you used to use during your neat preparation for biology chemistry and physics for biology i used to use ncert and biohack for chemistry i used to use ncert and chemhack and for physics i read from my coaching material and i used hc verma as a reference for solving the problem so sadhvika how you use the biohack and chemhack this is my biohack which i used during my neat preparation of biology this uh, for example cell the unit of life is the chapter which i used to revise from biohack then i used to take a white paper and then i used to read the question and i used to write the answer on the white papers all my answers at one go and from the back of from the back what answers are written i used to verify them from that and then for example if i did not get any question in the first go and then i used to read that question and i used to search where it was given in the ncert and those uh, and that topic i used to revise it so many times until i get it so how many times if if i did not get that question if i attended biohack second time also then i used to revise it again so in this way it helped me to revise ncert especially my weak points and the points which i used to forget multiple times and thus it helped me strengthen my weak topics in biology and this diagram labeling questions also i used to solve from biohack which i found very useful so sadhvika how did you use chemhack for the chemhack book also i followed the same strategy i used to read the question and i used to write the answer on the white paper and the question i did not get i again used to go back to the ncert and read the whole topic again so i used to revise it multiple times again and again till i get perfect at that topic So I use chemhack in the same method as I use biohack. This is my biohack and this is my chemhack, sir. It was nice meeting with you. Thank you, sir.